Man, it's a good weapon, but they must have, uh... They must have, like, messed with the durability of it. Uh, Frank, there seems to be a dancer throwing up in the Americana Casino. Uh, of course, as soon as I leave, too. Love it. Alright, we'll go back and grab her real quick. Because I at least can carry her, so I don't have to worry about her terrible fucking pathing. <sighs> Sometimes these survivors just have, like, Mason's Dead by Daylight pathing. Wow, oh, Lady Yule, right? Hey there. Wait, you're not Josh. Where do you run off to? Josh? Yeah, the nice little bachelor party that kept buying me drinks. Man, something smells like it died out there. Uh, I mean, you did also just puke on the floor, lady. And you just puked again, right on my shoes. Well, you should come with me. It isn't safe out here. I can take you to the safe house. Sounds kind of fun, like a party. Wait, no, that's not what I meant. Never mind, let's just get going. Wow, you're really wasted, aren't you? A ripper? Yeah. A saw blade with a saw blade makes the ripper. I have to restart my playthrough of uh, the OG Dead Rising 2. I was going after one of the trophies to, uh, to rescue all the survivors. Since in the first game, that was actually a lot easier than I thought, uh, rescuing everybody. But there is a couple of like unmarked survivors, which always seem like they're the worst ones to get. But um, there's like... There's like a unmarked story that's called Tape It or Die, where in order to rescue one of the dudes, you have to bring him like the schematics to make like a to make an item. And then you can't you have to like rescue the other guys on like day four. So basically in like overtime mode. And it's it's not like the worst thing ever, but like just a guide that I was watching for some reason. Uh, the Tape and Died crew showed up at a different time for him, and then when I went to go do it, it was, uh, unavailable. Beauty. And it just seems like every time I've been trying to, like, look up a guide on how to, like, uh, effectively, like, get them, I have been giving, like, a different time almost in every single fucking guide on how to get them. And they're in such an inconvenient spot, too. They're in the, uh... They're in the mall, like, sports store. There's, like, a little door there that you have to, like... Uh, that's basically locked. And it only unlocks during when the unmarked quest becomes available. The hardest part is just figuring out when that quest actually becomes available, though. Yeah, it seems like it's been different almost every playthrough that I've done. Or every guide that I've done when it actually opens up. Or sometimes the guides will just, like, not even tell me when. Zombie chow now. I have a 
peace out that after this. You need to pay attention out here, buddy. Buddy. Um, thanks. Rebecca Chang, Channel 6 Action News. Frank West. Oh, I know you. You used to be a kind of a hero of mine before you got washed up. You homesick for zombies? What are you doing here? Hey, I came to help with your story. I think Cure's being set up. My exclusive tape says otherwise, and I don't exactly need your help. It doesn't have to be a contest, lady. I help you, you help me. Simple. Where'd you get that tape from, darling? Reporters don't reveal their sources, Frank. Not real ones, anyway. I wouldn't underestimate Frank West, sweetheart. I got some pictures you might be interested in. Okay, let's see what you got. Not so fast. You gotta throw the old dog a bone before he does any tricks. Okay, maybe I'll let you tag along for a while. That's more like it. I can't tell you my source, but there is a central security room. There'll be footage of everything that happened there. The more and more I, I play this game, I think is. the more that I like Chuck as a character over Frank. Yours, I show you mine. Where's your crew? Mm. They ran off with all the. I know that the Frank in this game is I supposed to be a different voice actor, but his character just constantly sounds like he's congested and just stuffy all the time. Look, I can take you to the arena security room. Talk to me when you're ready to go. Uh. Nice. Hey, the keys. I don't think I can actually access the lock boxes up until the uh, the part where TK starts like looting the uh, casinos. Uh, there's a bathroom if you need to take a rest. Talk to me when you're ready to leave. Let's go. Auto save will save my ass. I don't actually take the money hacker with me. I don't think there's any ATMs in this part, but. Sorry, Rebecca. Oh my God. Hey, Rebecca, are you gonna move? I'm stealing my money. In your bra straps, lady. Damn it. I have no idea how you would survive out here on your own. Just push the button, lady. I hope I don't have to do everything for you. Well, what are you waiting for? Ah, oh, poor buddy. Just admiring your skills. Poor buddy got hairball.
still kind of irks me a bit that uh. I'm gonna have to break it down. Here, let me try. Shit, I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh yeah, it still kind of irks me a bit that the fucking. Uh, I did two new emotes, so I'm at my cap of five. Uh, and then I need to figure out what to do for an animated you emote. Went to journalism school? But I know the beans one is available, but the fucking clown one is still unaccepted by Twitch. What a mess. Well, this just gets better and better. Wow, looks like somebody didn't like the show much. You should get this on video. Uh, I love my stupid cat. They didn't want us to see yeah, what really I'm... went down. I think once I get access to the standard ones, uh, the like free emotes, I think eventually I'll move all the cats into like the free category. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I'll trade out like the beans one with like another uh, like I'm game character sure or something, just like a funny one. But it definitely proves someone's covering up what really happened. Not a bad lead, kiddo. Okay. Where are you guys now heading? It's time to show me those pictures. Oh, you guys hanging out with Ollie? Frank, you need to get All right. back to the bunker. Give me sugar. Now. What is it, Stacy? Love you. Love you. The report. Love you, baby. Can you get back here? You gonna play with Lily and Bailey? I'm on my way. Yeah. Wait, who is that? Just a friend. Yeah, they're gonna play with Alice. The leader of Cure. Gotta go. You can't ditch me for long. Yeah, I don't understand what it is, but like, I guess I just never understood why Twitch is a uh, exception for like certain emotes. It's just odd. Oh, I hope my skateboard lasts quite a bit. I'm gonna need that to get back. I do not have a lot of time. I need the spirit of Tony Hawk to rescue me right now. Or Skate 3 Jesus to help me. I gotta get into the room. You sure came through in a pool. I'm pretty sure in this game, though, time freezes when you're inside the safe house. You haven't been able to find your keys yet? Hey. And a man like you, real American, helping out trash like this. You don't need that kind of publicity, pal. Sullivan, I think Cure is being set up. I saw it on the TV with my own eyes. Explain how that little trick works. There's something else going on here, Sullivan. I found some evidence at the arena of a cover-up. I've got a feeling TK, the host of that game show, is involved somehow. I saw him backstage at his show, swapping a briefcase of money with the guy they showed on TV starting this outbreak. <laughs> could have told me that the front door was locked. Hey, you're that TV lady. Hey, you're that old guy. I'll make you a deal. You two do your little investigation. You see if you can help this troublemaker. But ain't no one gonna cover her ass when the military arrives. And she ain't allowed off the premises. I'll be guarding the door. Don't think I won't do what I have to do. <laughs> what was that all about? He just takes his job too seriously. Tell me. I don't know. That seems pretty reasonable, Frank. Security? Like honestly, all things considered. Trying to hide something. Everything was smashed to pieces. This is my uh, new friend. Stacy, I'm Rebecca Chang, Channel Six Action News. I'm here to help. Oh, 
You'll forgive me if I don't think it's very helpful that you accused my organization of a crime we didn't commit. Look, I don't know what's going on here, but clearly things are not as they seem. I put out the information I had at the time. Hey, I love a good catfight, but we're not getting anywhere unless we work together, ladies. Works for me. Whether you're innocent or guilty. I just want the truth. Thanks for the vote of confidence. But okay. We'll work together. I'll keep an eye on these monitors. And I'm going back out there to see what I can find out. I'll let you know if I see anything. Yes, they're leaving, Ray Ray. Alright, I'm gonna save here, and I'm gonna take a quick trip to the restroom, because I'm about to explode. I'm about to bust. I got a fucking cord stuck to my foot. God damn it. I just gotta pee, man. An asshole cat attacked me on the way to the fucking bathroom. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna follow the guide anymore. I think I'll probably just end up doing my own thing. Yeah, what was the guy that I was even watching anyways? Okay, yeah, it was literally just like a step-by-step -step guide to a... Uh, on just like a first playthrough, how to play the game. So let's go beat up Chuck. Seems like the hacker takes less charges to a... Uh actually hack shit now. I'm gonna save it only for ATMs, since that's what's gonna net us the most money. Yeah, I think Chuck is over this way. This boss fight can be pretty rough, though, but I think it's the same strategy as Leon, just getting him to try to crash into a fence. 
And also, knowing now that he drops alcohol if I uh, hit him during his healing animation also makes the fight a little bit easier. Whoa, chill. Okay, sorry. Didn't know it was yours. It's a nice bike, though. Hey, sorry, buddy. I thought you were one of those crazies. I just can't trust people anymore. I've been dealing with nut bars all day long. These zombies. They're annoying, sure, but they're easy to kill. Well, kind of, kind of funny. The real threat is the people. An outbreak like this does things to men. The violence, the death, seeing loved ones die. Change. Makes people snap. Just like that. People just like you and me. Just when humanity should be coming together, they turn on each other instead. I've got a daughter to protect. I won't let anything get in my way. Your daughter? Listen, uh, I can take you both back to the safe house. Katie needs her Zombrex every 24 hours. Right, baby? Oh, your daughter. Do you know what would happen if she didn't get her Zombrex every day? But I would never let that happen. We still have some time, Katie. I'll find something that kills me. Hey, look, let's get you and your daughter back to the safe house so that... Get the hell away from her. Ooh, crap. You're just one of those nut bars! You just want You're to just one of those nut bars! <laughs> Don't want You've got some major issues. Frank, this isn't the time to be skateboarded. Nice, dude. We got him fucking. Oh, never mind. God damn it. Fuck that zombie, dude. Easily could have had that, that fucking zombie didn't just grab me. Well, anyways, uh, like I was saying, that's pretty much what you want to do is get him stuck in the fence. Fuck, Chuck. God, fuck, dude. I hate that so much that he can just deal damage out of nowhere.
Oh my god, that's so annoying when it does that. I think what happens is like... He and you both get stuck in the environment, so it just continues this chain of just like infinite damage. Yeah, like you basically collide into the object and like there's no way for you to get out, so you just take infinite damage. It's so fucking annoying though. I used to think Anton was one of the worst boss fights, but I think Chuck is probably one of my least favorites to do. I definitely think the Leon fight is a little bit easier because, uh, I know a lot of people use the, uh, I know a lot of people use the fence tech against Leon, but honestly, I always found it much easier to just beat Leon by just using the, uh, motorbike and just crashing into the side of him. But that's pretty much what this fight is, it's just a Leon fight without access to the dirt bike. God fucking damn it, dude. I hate this fucking boss so goddamn much. That is honestly just so fucking stupid. I, I don't even think actually now it's getting stuck into the fence. I think that's just actually how it's programmed. If he just hits you, it just like KOs you. Chuck, it's gonna be so satisfying when I finally kill your ass. I was gonna say, of course, I finally started to get him and then he runs away.
check you, okay, buddy? Just hit himself with his own Molotov. I think that's actually just what happens. God, fuck you, Chuck. Gonna take your bike too. Are you all right, Katie? You're okay. You're safe now. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. I can't imagine. guy a few screws short of a workbench okay this place is nuts I swear I met that guy somewhere before Oh, does this body not just get left on the ground? Oh yeah. Nice. Well, that was way more difficult than it needed to be, but that's Dead Rising for you sometimes. Oh, the knee drop. Do I actually have that? I swear I do. I would have figured it'd be a key or something behind there. Alright, uh, we came here because we thought it'd be easy to meet girls, but we all froze up. That's rough. I know, all the ads about this place were such a lie since we've been here. We haven't seen a single girl gone wild. Couldn't meet any girls back home. Couldn't meet any girls on vacation. You know, maybe it's time to give up. I just can't take the rejection anymore. I don't need girls. For now on, I'm sticking to action figures. They never reject me. 
They always look perfect and do whatever I want. But girls' troubles aside, you can't stay here. It isn't safe. We've been safe so far. We'll stay here. Just come along to the safe house. Maybe one of the girls can help you with... Girls? There are girls inside a high-security safe house with no escape? What are we waiting for? I was waiting for you guys to catch another Molotov to the head. Yes. 